Yes, the first day is here. For most Bakersfield students, as your little ones get up for their first day, the teachers at their schools have been busy for weeks preparing for today. That's right. 23 ABC's Laura Acevedo live from downtown elementary with a first look at how the staff at that school prepared for today's big day. Good morning, Laura. Good morning, guys. That's right. School gets underway here in just a few hours, and the staff tells me they are very excited to have their students back in their classrooms and that they've been preparing for this for weeks. Summer is officially over for the Bakersfield City School District. Classes begin this morning for the largest elementary district in the area, made up of 42 schools. 300 of those students attend downtown school. To help get rid of those first day nerves, the students and parents are invited for a series of special activities. We'll have a meet and greet your new teacher with parents and students invited into their teacher's classroom a half an hour before the day begins. And then when the bell rings, we'll usher the parents into the cafeteria for the principal's coffee. This is an annual event. We have to make our parents feel welcomed at the school and to share their ideas and thoughts with us. For the first time ever this year, the staff will receive the Smarter Balance Assessment test results to see where the school and the students are on Common Core classes. We tested our students in the spring in grades three through eight. We're very excited because we know they worked super hard along with their teachers and were well prepared. And for those children worried about homework on the first day of school, some good news for the students. First day, we don't give a lot of homework to the students. The parents get homework on the first day of school. They have to read through all the brochures, the policies and procedures, and sign, sign, sign. Now school starts here at 8.30 and just a friendly reminder to parents, head out the door with a little bit of extra time so you can avoid that early morning first day of school traffic. Reporting live in downtown Bakersfield, Laura Acevedo, 23 ABC News. Now let's head over to 23 ABC's Leslie Marin in East Bakersfield with a look at how the high schools got ready for today's big day.